man? Is that you, man? How you doing, man? Oh, not bad. Not How bad. How you doing, man? Not bad, buddy. You got any smoke? Hey, man. You got smoke? Man, you got... I tell you, man. Sit. I don't got any smoke or nothing, man. But, you know, what I do got, I mean, I got a good watch. There was, like, this half eaten hamburger on the ground. I went for it. And a raccoon came up and tried to grab the hamburger. It's not all destitution and broken dreams out here. We got a little bit of what you like to call soul. Right. Let me show you guys a bit of what I've been working on out here in the street. Soul and love. This is my home. You know, I'll be out here like 2 a.m. at night. You know, people tell me to shut up. I don't give a fuck. You know all the big bangers and prize bangers came in the area and they fucked it all up, man. They fucked everything up, man. Fuck them and fuck all their city way, man. You know, I wouldn't be where I am if it wasn't for all those fuckers. Forgot a bit of my kitchen over here. Uh, you can see I had my Frank's Red Hot Sauce. I only got another one there. I, I got a bit. I got my favorite suit right there, my Nike suit. I got my favorite one. I can't find the other one, but I'm sure it's somewhere here if I clean it up. Is it dog? Fuck it. Ah, I'm hated. This is crazy. Frank you know, they say it's hard growing up on the streets, but I didn't know nothing any better than that, you know? I was born on the street. Some even think that maybe my mom is a rat, she but I don't ball. know. Fucking nobody came to my birthday party. Oh, And so, you know, after a long day of hustle and bustle in the city, you know, I like to come back here and this is a bit of a quiet, wind-down spot. I like to get a bit of my reading done here, a bit of quiet reflecting on myself. But mainly, the best part about here is it's wide open for days. As you can see, I get a little bit hungry, so I come on. I do a bit of my grades if I can have, you know, I get my big grades going on there, you know. Had a long, hot day, maybe I need a little bit of heat. Sometimes every once in a while you find something that's kind of good. Like bag of chips. Oh my god. Shit. Oh my goodness. Sometimes you find something out here that's so good you gotta tell everyone back in the city. You go over there and say, Look what the fuck I found! Get! You can trade them. A lot of people don't want to trade food for crackers, but every once in a while you find a crackhead who probably hasn't eaten in two weeks. They'll trade you some fucking good rock for a chip. They'll trade you fucking down for some fucking hot dog bun. Those are the guys you want to make friends with. Those are the guys that you really want to get in tight with. So I live here at number four. Okay? As you can see, there's my neighbor number five right there. This is mine. Oh, the, the best thing probably 
about number four. And then you can get down here real low. Okay? You can grab this stick. Grab this powder. You can kind of make this help that this pill. Okay? And then you get down. Get your head on that little pill. Okay? And then you kind of put a bit of things on top of you there. You gotta stay warm. Good for insulation. Good to keep the bug out. You gonna keep the rain off, you know? You gonna keep the rain off. You still gonna go wake up wet and cold. Nope. Don't make that mistake again, that's for sure. So yeah, you know, you just lay down here. You think about what you gonna do tomorrow, who you gonna rob, what you gonna steal, who you gonna steal. I remember in middle school, me and my friends used to listen to emo music because we were so sad all the time. But now, I look back to my childhood and I realize it wasn't too bad. I wasn't living on the streets and smoking crack. That was my teenhood. <laughs>